Hey guys, Dusty Baker of Cross Timbers Bison. Welcome back to the channel. Thank you for watching. Going to do a little working of these Texas 4 Bison. And remember, I brought them over from the new ranch. These are part of the original Texas 16 is what I like to call. Had them at the new ranch, pulled these guys out. I felt like they needed a lot of attention. You got two young bulls right here. They're about two years old. Malnutrition, need warmer need some other stuff uh, to kind of give them a little boost and uh, then we've got a cow over here she's thin as you can tell and then she's got a little calf here uh, that Kevin likes to call uh, popcorn little fella he's got this little belly on him so uh, just to give you an idea um, you probably can't see it very well but anytime that you see a red dog which is a, a two or three month old bison calf right here and they've got a big belly on them, a low sagging belly, like, like they've been eating a bunch, basically means that he has been either grazing or eating grain or, or hay, basically not nursing on mom. Well, if you look at mom, she uh, hasn't had, uh, she's not producing very much. I have seen him try to nurse. I don't know if he's getting milk out of her or not, but her health is not good enough for to raise that little calf. So we've got to get her taken care of and get the calf taken care of as well. The two bulls are basically going to stay here. The calf will stay here. And then that cow, once she's better, will probably eventually get her back over to the new property, uh, to the new ranch. So it's just easier here to feed them and got more eyes on them. We're going to put these bulls in with our other bulls that we currently have over here in another lot we're gonna vaccinate them first and get them taken care of by the way that little calf i thought it was a bull it is a heifer we have a little heifer calf Five. No, it's five per animal. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah.
Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed the video today of Kevin and I working those Texas four. The mama cow, she needs a lot of love. And I know I've said that through this whole video and I hope she makes it. And uh, we did what we could to, to try to save her. She was already pretty malnutritioned and, and, and unhealthy when we got her, which passed on to popcorn. And uh, so hopefully we can get mama going, especially popcorn, gotta get popcorn taken care of. Now those two bulls are gonna go on feed. 
we just put those two bulls with the rest of our bulls those are our feeder bulls and then so uh those bulls will actually be with lumpy so they'll be hanging out with lumpy for a while and whatnot we'll keep you updated on everything i'll keep you updated with lumpy i thank you for all the comments um with lumpy and uh that you guys gave um i'll let you know what we're gonna do with lumpy over time and uh in the meantime, we're going to keep taking care of him before I make a decision, before my wife and I make a decision. I think we're getting closer on a decision. So anyways, hanging out at the new ranch, guys, and I can't wait for you guys to see all the work we put in on this place and um, getting Big Joe over here and, and showing, showing him at the new place and, and letting him out here. So I can't wait to show you guys all that. And uh, anyways, thank you for watching today. We'll keep you updated with the new ranch and the original ranch with Dunbar and his ladies and Big Joe and his ladies. Thank you, guys.